to open the latitude 5480, you turn it over, and there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight screws. These are screws that will stay with the laptop so they won't come out. And there's a little notch in the plastic panel at the back here which you can put in a little jimmy tool or flat tip screwdriver and give you some leverage. Although this laptop does use a lot of plastic clips compared to older latitude models, so it is a little bit more challenging and scary to open this laptop. I've, I've had to open my fair share of 5480s and they have a tendency to split in the bottom part here. So do be careful when you open this laptop and go slow. So yeah, it will require a lot of force. Um, be careful not to split the cover. And these are M6 2.5 uh, 6.3 screws, apparently captive, so they, they stay in place. And um, this is the bottom. This is the bottom panel with a bunch of more, a bunch of different indicators. And this is the internals itself. This has a three cell, forty two watt hour battery. This laptop has two DDR4 sodium modules. That is for your Wi-Fi card. This particular has an Intel, Intel Wi-Fi card. And there's also space there for presumably the WWAN chip. Now this laptop has space for an M.2 drive, or you can also put in a regular two and a half inch drive in instead also. And there is probably space for a longer battery on higher end models. We got one heat pipe cooling the processor and it goes over presumably the chipset, a fan that intakes air and then blows it out the back. The CMOS battery is there. The charging port is modular so if it wears down you can easily replace it. The display comes in through here and goes into here. The USB ports are soldered, so if they wear out, you will need to resolder them. And the dual speakers here at the bottom. These are just the dual speakers. And there really isn't much in. We can go ahead. This drive is connected to the main board via a cable. Okay, these are not captive screws, but never mind. And you will find that this particular configuration of the 5480 has a 500 gigabyte laptop thin hard disk drive from Seagate. So you can see there's also a ribbon cable that goes to the activity LED from the motherboard. Let's put this back in. And that's going to be it for the internals of this Latitude 5480.